Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying three items from Frankfurt. These are the Frankfurt Kellogg's Rice Krispies Milk, Chocolate, and Cereal Eggs. And I have the Milk Chocolate Bunny and the White uh, Cookies and Cream Bunny. The bunnies were both bought at Dollar Tree. They were $1.25. So everybody knows Dollar Tree's raised their prices now. So it's $1.25 in our area too. Uh, people had asked me that if, if they had gone up in our area. Yep. Yes, they have. These were actually sent to us from Frankfurt. So a big thanks to Frankfurt for sending us these. We actually went on a hunt for these in the stores around us. Uh, we were in lots and lots and lots of stores. Didn't see them anywhere. Don't see them in our area. So, you'll have to let us know in the comments, have you seen the eggs in your area? Because that will be helpful to other people watching the video. So, we don't know how much they cost. Don't know how much they cost. I love how they are. I was not expecting that. That's what you get. That's how many you get. I love how they're individually wrapped and they have the Rice Krispies color mm -hmm, the blue. Uh, that they use. I think that is awesome. Uh, it says there are five servings of four eggs, so you get about 20 eggs in here. Now, we have been able to find the Rice Krispies bunnies, Yes. It's not the eggs. Right. So, the Rice Krispies uh, bunny and the Apple Jacks bunny, they're both at Walmart. You can find those at Walmart. And they are, of course, in the uh, Easter section. But four of these eggs are 160 calories. Not bad. You know, I'm going to have the same comment about these I had about the bunny. Mm -hmm. There's not much cereal in them. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you don't really get, you get a little bit of the crunch, but it's almost like they ground them up too fine. Mm -hmm. To where you never get any crunch out of them. And, and that's, that's a shame. That's kind of the, the whole point of having the Rice Krispies is wanting the crunch. We said that about the bunny. We also said that we tried the Frankfurt uh, Fruity Pebbles. Mm-hmm. It was the cocoa one. Cocoa pebbles. So the Fruity Pebbles tasted like Fruity Pebbles. Mm -hmm. It really did. Spoiler alert if you didn't watch the video. But it really tasted <coughs> like, because it's a very distinct flavor. The Cocoa Pebbles one tastes just like milk chocolate. And this tastes a lot like that milk chocolate. Yeah. It, it's just a lot of milk chocolate. And you really can't tell there's cereal there. Mm. It's good though. It's good. I, I like them. It's just, just don't expect the little, the little crunches like you would get in a Nestle no. Crunch or anything like that. No, you cannot tell whatsoever that they used Rice Krispies cereal in mm. that. But anybody that gets those is going to be happy because it is actually really good chocolate. Yeah. So, we have tried other brands of uh, solid chocolate bunnies, but we hadn't tried the Frankfurt brand, believe it or not. After all these years, well, we put my chocolate bunnies, except for this channel, a long time ago. Yeah, that's true, because our kids are grown, yeah, and so we grown. just buy for the for the <coughs> grandkids. Uh, this is the milk chocolate, half of the package. There's two servings in the container. Half the package is 160 calories, or if you eat the entire bunny, it's 310 calories, which isn't bad. No. I always used to... Um, of course, they never had solid bunnies, when, or at least mom and dad never bought them. Um, I always with the hollow bunnies, and you um, you save them for about three days. It's about how long they lasted for me. I don't remember my parents being big on on buying big the big things. Yeah, they would buy me smaller things. Little toys and stuff. No, I mean smaller candy. Oh, they would buy yeah. me like. Cadbury cream eggs and stuff like that. Smaller things, but not big bunnies right. like this. Right, I always got a big bunny. But I think this is, I, I do love the idea of giving a big bunny. What did you think of the chocolate in that compared to the egg? It's similar, but it's different. The egg is better. Yeah, the egg is a little, it seems higher quality chocolate. Mm -hmm. Maybe the sweetness from the cereal, maybe the cereal added some sweetness to it. I don't some know. Flavor. I'm not saying that these don't have a difference in flavor, but maybe that Rice Krispie did make it a little different mm -hmm. out of flavor. Uh, yeah, it may be, yeah, and because... the bunny, honestly, I'd probably buy a different brand of bunny. I would too. I really don't care for that, yeah. brand, that bunny. I don't care for that. That's why I was kind of trying to fill you it, out. It tastes like a cheaper chocolate, I, to be honest. Yeah, I don't like the milk chocolate bunny, but I love the Rice Krispies yeah. egg. The, the Rice Krispies eggs, are very very sweet and it tastes like a very nice milk chocolate 
the milk chocolate bunny came across as a chemical. Mm -hmm. It I really agree. did, and and I, that's why I wanted to ask you because I didn't know if you felt I mean, the same. I mean, a kid's gonna eat it; they don't care. But um, but as an adult, you taste it, and you're like, eh. and and so to be fair, we bought these at Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree had other brands right next to this brand. Yeah. So I would buy the other brand um, over this. I, that's just the truth. Half a package for the cookies and cream is 170 or 340 for the entire bunning. That white, um, it's definitely not white chocolate, the white confection. Mm -hmm. um, it's very sweet, vanilla flavored, but I don't know. I don't really get a, the cookies part. I, like I think it, it it's sweet. It doesn't have the chemical flavor that the milk no, chocolate has. It's kind of gritty. But it um, it doesn't remind me of almond bark. And no, it's not white chocolate. It's not as sweet as white chocolate. But it, it, there is a sweetness to it. Your kids aren't going to complain. Okay? Yeah, out of the two, I would buy the cookies and cream. You're watching this video because you want to know what the best buy is, I'm sure. I would not buy either one of these bunnies. No, get, if they see these, get these. I'd buy the Russell Stover. Yeah. I'd buy the Russell Stover. <laughs> you can get the Russell Stover anywhere. I would buy the Russell Stover bunny. Pass on these bunnies. Even if you have to pay a little bit more, it's worth it. But now those Rice Krispies eggs They're good. are very good. To They're buy very thing nice. Sprinkle them in the basket. Yes, I think it would be adorable because I love those uh, the, the color. And where did we see where you could buy, oh, I know, World Market. If you haven't been in World Market in a while, they have bags instead of buying Easter grass, they have paper. paper. It's like shredded colorful paper. Yeah, shredded colorful paper that you can buy for the Easter basket. And I think eco friendly. Yeah, it's eco friendly. I think that, I just think that's a cool idea. Because that grass gets everywhere when yeah. you buy it. Yeah. Um, and it's plastic. It's probably not the best thing to throw away. Probably not. So if you take anything out of this video, buy these if you see them if yeah. you see them that's the thing i hope you can find them and if you do let me know where you found them so i hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching